Welcome to this channel. Today, i like to share with you four popular traditional Chinese martial art classic in the Ming and the Qing dynasty. So, uh, this four popular classic is known by those who really study and uh, investigating and research into traditional Chinese martial arts. In the West, we need to know this. So we have a reference to know what is real, what is the truth, and we be able to screen out whatever which is not true. Now, the reason why I'm sharing this today is because yesterday I shared the uh, important point of the section 4 and 5 of the S21. And many of our martial art friends asking me many questions with uh, Facebook chatting. So I decide to share this with you so that once for all, we got things clear because we cannot afford to have all kinds of hearsay. Like yesterday, some friend, Wing Chun friend, sent me another YouTube. Uh, in the YouTube, it says that uh, because Mui and Chi Sim found out that uh, at that time, the Shaolin martial is not uh, capable to fight the Taoist uh, martial arts. So Mui designed this Wing Chun. And what does the person do? Wing Chun 1960s, straight line. Not even have that, 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 that sphere handling of the short strike, which is I have shared yesterday in the section four and five of the S21. You know there's a disaster when you're keeping going like that. This grandmaster say, that grandmaster say, and it turns out all this grandmaster have no idea what is going on. Now, I'm not saying that I know what is going on. I'm saying that that is ancient uh, Kung Fu classic we can base on. We need to know that if you base thing on this grandmaster said, that grandmaster said, this Jisim fighting uh, 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 white elbow and all this eyeballs and all this kind of thing, you will never be able to face this Xiaodong. <clears throat> Not to mention that you need to face the Western MMA. Okay? That is the bottom line. The world is really solid world. Do you have the tangible technology that is the bottom line nobody will give face now other friend is talking about this tai chi tai chi circle this circle that and all this kind of thing so today i like to share this with you once for all we in the west need to clean the done thing up okay I'm 60 something already. My time is running out. How many millions people is today is they are not practiced traditional Chinese martial. They are practiced cult. My grandmaster say this, my this grandmaster say this, that grandmaster say that. And yet none of those grandmaster by this standard know what the heck they're talking about. So that's why you cannot answer to Xi Xiaodong if you 
if you have the base on this, the Kung Fu of this four classic, any one of the four classic will be able to answer to Si Xiao Dong. Okay? So let's look into it. The first classic, okay, so this is starting at 1560s era to 1780s era, okay? So there are four classic nobody can deny disregard of you like it or not disregard of what you call your grandmaster okay and this standard is high up there in past 100 years there's no grandmaster including bruce lee have that type of achievement now i'm not putting down bruce lee of course bruce lee is better than me but you have to look into the standard Okay, so the first is Wu Pian, Wu Pian by Tang Sun Zhi. The second is the chapter 14 of General Qi Ji Guang. The third is the Shaolin Short Strike Classic. The fourth is the Chang Family Martial Art Books. Okay. So there are four of them. Now, the Chang family martial art book have its uniqueness. However, it is not as comprehensive and has, as in-depth with this thing. We know that this tree is military related. Okay. The Chang family book is uh, it have its uniqueness, it have its uh, strong point, but it is not at this uh, this level. Okay. So where is Tai Chi come from? Tai Chi classic from Wang Zhongyue come is known at 1882. Okay. So chronologically, this is what happened. Now today, you look at, you try to, to, to solve the entire world with your Tai Chi. And how many people know this? How many grandmaster of the Tai Chi know this thing exists and what is this talking about? How many of those uh, so-called researchers know this exists and know exactly what it is? So, the reason why I wrote this two book, Kung Fu 1560s and the Restricting Wing Chun, is to present these three books to the West. And we know that the 1850 Wing Chun Siu Lim Tao writing is an offspring of this. Okay? So when we want to talk about Wing Chun, we better know what the heck is going on with this. Not get into this Tai Chi, which is 1882. What the heck is that? And you want to talk about the momentum and everything and so forth. Circular and all this kind of thing, it is here. The body shoot in and everything it is here okay because this is prior to the 1850s wing chun shi lin tao kit and your 1960 is here that's why 1960 there's a lot of thing which is using the tai chi stuff today not knowing that this exists so that become a disaster now even bruce lee bruce lee talk about the uh the, the, the flow, closing the gap. You know what? 460 years ago, Chi Chi Guang have covered what Bruce Lee talk, uh, Bruce Lee present in just eight character, eight Chinese character. Shi Shi Xiang Chen, Bian Hua Wu Chong, in chapter 14. Okay? So, just in eight character, 
uh, General Chi Chi Guang cover what Bruce Lee said and more. Okay. So uh, that is in the chapter 14. Okay. So Si Si Xiang Chen meaning momentum lead to another momentum one momentum lead from another momentum meaning that there is limitless of change okay and of course general chi chi guang have his uh his implementation and so forth in the chapter 14 which is uh i, I present in the uh in the uh, eight, uh 15 six kung fu 1560 bruce know what it is bruce is a smart man but bruce do not get that advance compared with general chi chi guang so i'm not putting down bruce here but we need to be really careful okay you need to see what is the high tech and in fact how many in the history of the chinese thousand years of uh, 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 history can can uh, compete, compare with uh, General Chi Chi Guang. General Chi Chi Guang is the top fifth general or national hero of China for thousand years. So those are extraordinary people, okay? And that's why I say that the uh, Bruce Lee's flow, using no way as way and those kind of things, Bruce is right. However, Bruce do not get into the detail and get to that level like General Chi Chi Guang. General Chi Chi Guang can say it in eight character, eight Chinese character. Si si xiang chen bian hua wu qiong. And then General Chi Chi Guang describe the details in chapter 14 in just a paragraph. Bruce is not up there. But of course, Bruce know something is something is uh is uh, is there up there okay so we need to be able to know this thing okay that this thing exists not to make somebody god don't make bruce lee god make bruce lee a great grandmaster but not make bruce lee god because he's not and so do all those wing chun grandmaster Look at their contribution, but don't put them, make them as God. Because when you slam down by this, you can see where does all those grandmasters stand for past 100 years. Okay. <coughs> this is the reality. This is real Chinese, ancient Chinese. Not today's kung, uh, kung Fu movie. Okay? You want to face MMA? You better get this out. For example, like in Chang Shi Wu Ji Su, the uh, Chang family's uh, the, 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 the martial art books, martial art techniques books, it talk about Zhong Qi. Okay, the middle chi. And of course here, you know, if you if you read those two books, there are all kinds of breathing and stuff. While well, Zhong Qi stuff is also, if you look at today's uh, sports science, people know that there's a breathing, a piston breathing. Today, the Western sports science know that there's a piston, uh, piston breathing where your diaphragm and your pelvis floor is uh, synchronized and the uh, western sports science today know that you can pressurize pressurize this internally to to support your uh your, your spine or your core stability and uh, deal with the intra abdomen pressure the Zhong Qi is a part of this here. So if you develop the Zhong Qi and you develop 
the, 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 the Western sports science, like the core stability, the bracing and so forth, you can know that, oh, they are talking, the Chinese is talking this. And even more in-depth of the handling. Today's sports science stuff is good. It's very scientific and be able to analyze, but it is not as deep because you have a four, 400 years of, uh, of people is testing that thing. So it's like artificial intelligence, even by just try and error with this uh, hundreds of thousands of people's try and error, you know that you gather the data, you know the pattern. So the Chinese martial arts have that, not to mention that they went into Samadhi where they don't their body. And today we have to rely on the machine monitor. Now, using machine monitoring is good so that everybody be able to monitor themselves. Using Samadhi, you got a problem because you need to get up to that level in order to know what is going on. It's like the six core element. And it's just like the S21. If you're not uh, aware of your body layer by layer, you have no idea what it is. But if you use uh, the high tech today, you, you can check it. And so science is very good. The support science is very good. You can compare note and we can monitoring each other. So, so you can uh, uh, validate each other. Okay. So now, this is your dealing with the pressurize of your, 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 your core for your, for your torso stability and so forth. So the Chinese call it bucket. Like the, 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 the bucket, you know, people uh, uh, take the bucket and the, the bucket is uh, filled with water. People, the Chinese call it here and today you can see the spot sign call it a cylinder. So because it's human body and uh, it is disregard of it is east or west or who doing it, if it's human body, it's human body. Okay. Now the Chinese problem as where I mentioned that because you need a certain level of training and because you don't have the scientific measurement. <clears throat> It makes training really difficult. So that, that's the reason why, like in the Wing Chun Inception, I put all this measurement there because you can read all this book, but if you never really achieve it, you don't have a Sifu to really verify, confirm to you, you don't know what it is. Now, with the scientific, we can do a mass production. A, a, a mass education. Everybody just get the, the the tools and everybody can measure. Does one get there or not? Okay. So the East and West both have their strength and uh, that has to be combined to, to, to make a better uh, traditional Chinese Kung Fu. Otherwise, there's it's hopeless. Okay. And you, you, that's why I say that you talk about internal. How many people know about this uh, intra abdominal pressure handling and the piston breathing? Most today in so called internal is keeping talking about their spine, they are uh, tucking the tailbone, and yet they don't know about the piston breathing. They don't know that the way how they do things can cause can cause the, uh, this, this, the, the, this hernia. So, so that's what I open question to everybody. Do you, 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 you talk about the Chinese internal art? Do you know why that cause hernia, the this hernia? And uh, do you know how to uh, protect your spine, stabilize your spine, your torso, your core? Are you serious that you say that, oh, if I straighten my spine, I'll get fudging uh, my power from my spine? Are you serious for that? Look into the Western sports science. Those are 
problematic type of idea. And so now you got a problem there. It's no longer following this. The ancient Chinese is no longer following the Western sports science, which is a science, it is a medical science for rehabilitation and so forth. So what do you get? So this is what I like to share with you. These four books, and of course this is in Chinese, difficult to read. That's why this three is in this two book, the the, the 1560s, uh, Kung Fu 1560 and Re uh, Restricting Wing Chun. You can see a big picture of what is going on with that, and 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 a lot of details because it's related to the Wing Chun, because Wing Chun have to base on this thing. Okay. And that's why, again, I get ballastic when people who, who know me, after I ask them to do this, 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 they don't do it. And uh, just go around doing whatever they want. And that's why, that's the reason why I part away from many grandmaster. Because in martial arts, in Chinese Kung Fu, stop to talk about your way, my way. Okay? You need to know the nature of the technology and be able to verify with the signs. Like, we, let's talk about Bruce Lee. Bruce is good. But do you know that after he passed away that, after Bruce passed away that, the, uh, the Buddhist, uh, uh, the, the grandmaster of the Buddhist who know who is the master, a real master of handling the chi and so forth in his book saying that even though he didn't point at uh, Bruce Lee's name, he, t he talked about this movie star. He said this thing is, must not be published because this type of training is killing oneself because he, the, the, the person of this training, which is mean Bruce Lee, do not handle the, the chi properly. Well, in today, 60 years later, if today's Bruce Lee is here, he know that what he trained, need to check in sports science like the training and recovery. And even today, sports science training and recovery is still not adequate to handle what the real chi cultivations of the ancient. The difficult part of the, the ancient thing is because you need to be able to hand your, handle your body. Like the, those who practice uh, Anapanasati of the Buddha teaching, those guru, they know their body. That's why today you can see that many universities doing research on those pe people who have that development to find out why and, and so forth. Like even in the biofeedback, they found out that the breathing resonance at six breaths per second, so forth, so forth, so forth. So science is good. It keep everybody honest, however, still young. This is good because you have a lot of human experience, but it is not very effective in teaching. And you can generate all kinds of uh, hearsays. The people who don't know will say, hey, you know, my grandmaster is this, this, this. My sifu is this, 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 this. And then they have no idea what it is. So it's like yesterday I, I, I pointed out that S21, somebody using a belt to practice the S21. You must be kidding. Do you know what the heck happened with this uh, IAP? How to handle that before you put the belt on? And, and that's why that's why I part away from all these people. Why? Because I don't want I don't want people to say, oh, I trained this with Hendrik. What 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 you trained with Hendrik? What Hendrik say you never listen. Okay. So don't use my name. And that's why I don't want even to use my name. Use this. Use the ancient teaching. Use the spot signs. The rest. Don't trust it until you can get the evidence measurable, confirmable, scientifically. Don't trust anything. 
Now, am I anti anybody? No, I don't. It is education. You need to have a standard. This is not making movie. So this is what I like to share with you. Okay. So now, four of this book, three is in the West already. With with, with this with these two books. This is in the West already. Okay. When I tell you what I'm going to do, that is after I have done it. I never say anything before I, I have done it. It's like engineering. When a company release a news for the product, you know the product is ready. The design is done. That's the way how I do things. When I say it, it is there already with all the evidence and so forth, so forth. So again, I'm not any kind of grandmaster and so forth, but uh, if we want to do things, do it properly. Do it in an objective way, rationally. Why we want to do that? Only this way we can progress. Look at the science, Western science uh, for past 60 years, the sports science. You see how much, how good it progressed. And like the my watch, my Garmin watch today, it be able to predict, estimate, either I'm overtraining or uh, I have not enough training. My Garmin watch, the, the, the 945 LTE can tell me that. Did I train overtrain that I need to stop? Or I am under training? or I'm in optimal. The sport science already have this, okay? So even though the sport science do not have all this data on the engine, but it is really solid thing. Now you look around, you have all this data for hundreds of years, but how many people even know that this four books exist? There is a reality of Chinese Kung Fu. So are we going to change it? Or what are we going to do? Keeping talking, oh, this grandmaster, this Bruce Lee. Sorry, this is 60 years after Bruce Lee. Okay. That's a reality. Do you know how many MMA players today which is much better than Bruce Lee? In terms of training and so forth? with the modern sports science. So the world is very simple. Either one with a solid base and progress or one vanish. And the reason for S21 is try my best to get this and this fused together, hopefully it can benefit many people and hopefully it be able to, 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 to go further or else don't kid ourselves. There's no traditional Chinese Kung Fu. Traditional Chinese Kung Fu in the big part have been gone since the Opium War 1840s. That's the truth because after 1840s, Many of the Chinese staff have already westernized. And like the Taiji staff for 18, uh, 1882, as Bruce Lee called it, it is just an exercise. It is just an exercise. Okay. It's not to, 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 to put uh, the, the jab at Taiji. It is just an exercise. In comparison with today's MMA, what is it? So 60 years ago, Bruce already know. So Bruce is a smart guy. Okay. The issue is that he have not. He doesn't have the information. And the people at that time, the Chinese at that time, is in the different era. Do not have this thing. 
So this is the world we are facing.